Hello everyone, welcome to part two of my Blu-ray collection video. We're going to start off with Solid Green, it's a good John Aston one. Then we have uh, The Money Pit, funny movie. We have a two set of uh, Teen Wolf 1 and 2. Next one we got is uh, The Last Dragon, it's a good martial art one. We have a good Nicolas Cage one here, Vengeance, it's a very good one. Next one we got is uh, Cincinnati Kid. Awesome movie. There are another two set here, um, Sister Act and Sister Act 2. Very good. Then we have uh, Primal, another good Nicolas Cage one. Next one we got is uh, Small Soldiers, one of my favorites, I love that one. Next one we got is um, New Jack City, got Wesley Snipes on that. Then we have uh, Priest, good movie. And add to that one, Legion. Another good one. Next one we got is uh, Mine. Love that. And uh, The Hand That Walks the Cradle. Good fellow one. Next one we got is um, Cobra. It's a good action one. Then we got uh, Howl. And uh, Automator. Good old Antonio Mandalas one. Next one we got is uh, Sleepy Hollow. Love that one. Then we have the CPL series, that sadly got cancelled. Good series as well. Then we have um, Cloudy with a Chance of Meatballs. We also have uh, the second one. Next one we got is um, Super. That's a good one. Next one we got is uh, Eliminators. Good. Next one we got is uh, Triangle. That's a good hard one. These up. Next one we got is a uh, trombo. That's a good one. And we have um, Ball vs. Mechanwell. Then we have um, No Holds Bar. It's a good uh, Hulk Hogan one. I love that one. And we have uh, The Fault in Our Stars. It's a good one. Then we have um, Hitchcock. Good movie. We have the uh, the original girl with a dragon tattoo set. All three good movies in that one. And then we have the new one to add to that. I prefer the originals though. Next one we got is um, Excess Baggage. Another good VHS cover one. A very good movie. Then we have um, Blood Diamond. Good. Then we have uh, The Replacements. So we've got a Keanu Reeves one. Next one we got is um, Confessions of a Dangerous Mind. It's a good movie. And we have um, A Royal Affair. Love that one. Next one we got is uh, Hit and One. It's a funny movie. Then we have um, Odds Against Tomorrow. Good old movie. Move on a bit. Then we have uh, Master and Commander. The Monuments Men. Memento, American History X, Paranoia, Block Stuck in Two Smoking Barrels, One in the Chamber, The Relic, that was a good home movie. Then we have the original um, Stalingrad. And we have the new one. And we have um, one lower one. And then we have 127 hours. And we have spookies. Now you see me. And the sequel. There's a little holographic one. It's really nice. And then we have. Um, Black Widow, love that one. Then we have uh, Parker. Then we have uh, Legacy of Wage, got a Brandon Lee one, got action one. Then we have The Wave, it's a good disaster one, along with uh, The Quake. It's two good movies right there. Then we have um, Oculus, 
Another good horror movie. Then we have a uh, Red Planet. Good one. There will be blood. The Interpreter. Lost in Space. That's a good movie. Next one we got is The Quest. Good old Van Damme one. Then we have Overboard. Pretty funny. Then we have Species. It's another good one. Add to that we have Species 2. Not bad. And then the twin set of Species 3 and 4. Awesome movies they are. Then we have um, Pile and Glory. Innocent Blood. Mrs. Nereva. Out of the Furnace. Good uh, Steven Seagal and a good man. Good movie. Next one we got is uh, USS Indianapolis. Good old Nicholas Cage one. Then we have uh, The Lawnmower Man. Gotta get the sequel one to that one. Then we have uh, Gangster Squad. Good one. Then we have uh, The Entity. So a good horror movie. Then we have uh, The Warriors. The next one is uh, Fly Away Home. Next one we got is uh, Casual Sex. Very funny movie. Leaving them up. Next one we got is uh, Jack and Jill. Very funny. Then we have um, Cruel. I love Cruel, that's a very good movie. Next one we got is um, 10,000 BC. That was very wonderful. And then we have uh, Notorious. Beyond the Cambalaba. Two good actors on that one. Next one we got is uh, Special Forces. It's a good uh, French one. And we have uh, Enemies Close. Another good Van Damme one. Then we have uh, Extra. It's a good alien one. Next one we got is uh, Cat 1 and Cat 1 2. Those are two good movies. We have uh, John Q. With Denzel Washington. There was a Gal one, the Pistol Whip. Love that one. Then we have uh, The Kid. I still prefer Young Guns. Then we have uh, Contact. Love Contact. Then we have um, Acts of Vengeance. A good Antonio Mandaris one. Then we have uh, Gone Girl with Ben Affleck. We have uh, Nightbreakers, a good uh, Australian zombie one, very funny. Then we have uh, Assassination, good action one. Then we have uh, Hit and Miss, which was uh, sadly cancelled. It was such a great show. Don't know why they do that, really. Very annoying. Then we have. Uh, Wallace and Gromit, the movie collection one. And then we have the World of Inventions. And we have um, 14 Blades, a good Donnie Yen one. Then we have um, The Graves of Wrath, good one. Next one we got is uh, This Is Where I Leave You. And uh, Man's Best Friend. And then we have uh, Rogue, got a Megan Fox one there. Good action one. Then we have um, Romeo and Juliet. Now we have uh, A Infiltration. Love that one, that was good. Then we have uh, Chernobyl. Good show. Then we have um, Dead in Tombstone. Good one. Then we have uh, Dead Again in Tombstone. Next one we got is uh, Made in Manhattan. I love that one. Then we got uh, Death Becomes Her, very funny movie. Then we have um, The Railway Man, awesome. Then we have uh, Adventures in Babysitting, that's a good one. Moving these up. Then we have um, Diner. Then we have a two set of uh, Body of Lies and Three Kings. Next one we got is uh, An Officer and a Gentleman. Next one we got is uh, Miss 45. It's a great movie. Then we have uh, Coal Mine's Daughter. It's a good music one. 
Then we have uh, Arachophobia. I love that one. Next one we got is um, Evil Speak. And House of Traps. Next one we got is uh, Maverick. Good movie. Next one we got is uh, The Recruit. Love that one. We have the free set box of uh, Urban Legends, I think. No, yeah, Urban Legend. that's it, yeah. All three movies. I already had one and two, but uh, I had to get this one because of the third one. They didn't uh, release it separately, so uh, that was kind of stupid, though. But uh, I'm glad I got all three anyway, and the box set is nice. So that's that. And for the last two on this one, we have um, The Word of Con to Garp. And the last one here is Steven Seagal's uh, On Deadly Ground. Thank you all for watching uh, part two of my Blu-ray collection and stay tuned for part three. Thank you.